Hey there Dave everyone, Jason DiPaolo here from the Edge Strength and Conditioning and I'm just going to talk about a few things that make a great workout. There's a few key things that stand out that make a great workout and I'm just going to go through a few of those. Now the first one is to have a dynamic warm-up. So preparing your body for like strenuous exercises or resistant exercises is always the best way to start a workout. It's much more better than doing a static stretching. Now I do see a lot of people not even going into doing a warm-up but a five minute warm up is all you need to do. You can do just the basic stuff like a basic walking lunges and squats and just some like skipping or something like that but not static stretches because that's um, shown to be more detrimental to your muscles. So compound lifts are the next thing. You've got to think of exercises that work two or more joints and work multiple muscles. Now this can be anything. This could be deadlifts which is a hinge movement. I've gone on about movement patterns before. Um, squats, uh, bench press, anything that uses multi joints and multi muscles is the staple of a really good training program. So the next thing I tell people is uh, the quality. You need to prioritize the quality of the reps uh, what you do. So a lot of people will uh, make the mistake of like overestimating their strength and thinking they're going to be able to sort of like bang out 20 reps or something. Another thing is um, overestimating how strong you are and thinking oh I can do that one rep max or my personal best and more likely you're going to be able you're going to be doing it with a bad form when you're in bad technique so you've got to prioritize all this and make sure the quality of your reps within the training system within a training routine is is the best you can be like you got to think the form has got to be on par you, your technique has got to be good yeah you, you might think oh I'm, I'm stronger I could probably lift more but you know your your technique and your form could break down and that could lead to injuries down the line so that's what I think quality is is the next best thing. So the next thing is you, you've got to push yourself. When you walk into the gym, you've got to think you've got to push yourself on the next session. Now I have mentioned that you, you've got to prioritize and have quality reps and make sure your form is good and technique is formed. But if you can get that down, then you can push yourself just a little at a time. Don't go, like I've said before, thinking, oh, I'm strong, I'm going to put on an extra 20 kilograms on my deadlift. And then your form goes. Just small, simple steps will be much better for you. So just push yourself. So if you think, oh, I can go stronger, put on an extra couple of biscuits on each end. That makes it a little bit more. So you're prioritizing and then you're slowly getting stronger over a period of time. This is how your body's going to get stronger, you're going to get fitter and more, more importantly you're going to get leaner and get that sort of lean fit look. And that's what everyone strives for. Now these are a few things that if you if you want to have a great workout, these are a few key things. It's like I say, you've got to have a dynamic warm up. That's a, that's a key thing to get all your muscles nice and warmed up. Um, do compound lifts in your, in your workouts. That's another mass you know movement patterns as well that I've said this before um, quality of reps uh, quality of your technique and form is really paramount as well and then the last one is to push yourself just that little bit every time you go into the gym and also like an addendum here just make sure that you do do a little stretch off afterwards a little cool down afterwards you know just to get your muscles relaxed and everything like that and then when you finish all that have a good meal, have get the protein back into your system, and then also have some quality sleep. All this together will make a really good workout and get you fitter, stronger, leaner, a lot more faster. So there you go. So I hope you like this little video here. Uh, my name is Jason Tapaoli from the Strength and Conditioning. If you do like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you can, I'll put a link onto my Instagram feed here or here. I don't know where I'm going to put it. Uh, please go onto that because I put a lot more on my Instagram and social media that I don't do on YouTube. Uh, so catch me on that. If you want any questions, just shoot me a message. I'll be more than happy to help you with any training. I'm a personal trainer and strength and conditioning coach, and I can help you with anything that you need. So hope you like this video, and I shall see you on another video coming real soon.